Come with me as we do a quick walk around tour on Kenzie Ruth, a 3055 Bayliner cruiser for sale at South Mountain Yachts. She's a 2002 model. She's extremely well equipped with the larger 5.7 Merc Cruiser engines, 250 horsepower each, radar, a Macrolon enclosure, and an extended swim platform. Starting off here at the bow, we see we have a windlass with anchor, line, and chain and a docking spotlight. This great big expansive foredeck is just made for a large cushion to lay out on. Coming down along the side, make note of this extra large slash window, which allows a lot of light into the cabin. We'll see as we enter. Notice we've got a couple year old bimini with the Macrolon, that hard Eisenglass, which doesn't yellow. Coming down to the transom, we see we've got a few additional rod holders in deck. And here's a great feature on this boat. The owner's added an extended swim platform, gives us another three feet. And as you can see, it's a great place to put a barbecue or prep table, or just put some deck chairs there. Here at the transom, we have trunk storage below. This is for a bait tank fill right here. We enter the vessel through this port side door. Off to starboard, we have our U-shaped seating. The table actually lowers and there's a large filler cushion for here to make it into a sun pad. Off to port, we've got our wet bar and storage underneath. And a little further forward, we have our companion seat with storage underneath. Here at the companion seat, we see we've got a grab rail and cup holders. Up here on the, this portion of the deck, we have a 110 outlet circling around. See, we have a double wide helm seat right here and up one step to the helm. There's a lot of upgrades on this boat. We've got the tilt steering wheel, the VHF radio, Furuno radar. We have a Garmin depth sounder GPS, an upgraded Hawkeye depth sounder also two-inch compass and for those of us that like to trim the boat out we have the Bennett trim tab level indicators right here so it's easy to see our balance on the boat. We've got a nice burled wood finish on the, on the dash circling around this is going to give us a view of the cockpit there's that nice large seating area and our companion seat right there. Access to the bow is up these molded in steps, one, two, and out to the foredeck. This is the view from the helm right here. We enter the cabin through this bifold center line door and down a few steps. Once we enter to port, we've got our fully lined fiberglass head with an upgrade freshwater flush jab scout top of the line toilet and pull out RV shower. Moving forward at the galley, we see below we have a large refrigerator for this size boat. Over here, we have drawer storage and a cabinet below the sink. On top of the counter, we've got a dual burner alcohol electric stove, cabinet storage, 
our microwave, and a flat screen TV. Notice how bright the cabin is with these large windows right there. Behind here, we've got a nice power panel and our DVD players right here. As we move forward, we see our large slant bed. It's over seven feet with storage below. And here we have another storage cabinet right here. Circling around, we have our sofa with a table. This area here also lowers to become a sleeping area and there's storage up underneath. Again, we have about six feet, five inches of headroom. We've got another storage cabinet right here. Multiple outlets. Bayliner does a very nice job with this boat. The beam is further forward, lots of headroom, lots of space. Moving aft to the mid cabin, we see we've got our privacy curtain right here, a nice hanging locker, stereo above, and back here, this is our double wide mid cabin, full beam. If you notice, there also is its own window for air and light. Circling back around, we see under the steps there's more storage. And this gives us an overview of the vessel. Kenzie Ruth is a very well cared for and has been through various owners. She's nice, neat, turnkey condition. And most important, she's lady clean. Viewer today, owner tomorrow at South Mountain Yachts. Thanks for viewing and give us a call.